welcome back to my channel. My name is Christina Mitchell and if you haven't already, go ahead and subscribe to my channel. We are going to be experiencing the Kat Von D Concealer. Kat Von D Locket Concealer Corrector. This was $25 at Sephora. This is what it feels like. in the shade deep 34 and this is the packaging for the box which is really cute and this is the packaging for the concealer now I've seen a lot of people rant and rave about this but I haven't seen a lot of women of color wearing it so I wanted to see how it would work for me so what I'm gonna do now is just put on the rest of my makeup and I'll be right back Okay, so now I've got majority of my makeup on. I just did my foundation and my brows. So I'm going to take this and get started. What I'm going to do is, uh, for this part of it, I'm going to use my beauty blender. And then if I decide to do a second trial and review, then I'll try it with a brush and let you guys know what I look like. So I'm just going to take a little bit on... Oops, Okay, so some fluid just came out and kind of squishing around. I thought it was really thick. I'm just going to take a little bit on my... Ooh, geez. I, ooh. <laughs> and I'm just going to put this on underneath my eye right there. So it is really... It's kind of fluid. It's like it wants to be creamy, but it's kind of fluid. The coverage so far is pretty decent. And I'm just going to put this over here. My only concern with it being so fluid is that it might get into the creases of my eye. And it might be like super matte or something and be drying. So that's my only concern right now. So I'm just going to place this where I want it and then blend it out with my beauty blender. So far so good on the color. Um, I can't tell if it oxidizes or not yet but I guess we'll see. With my face and body beauty blender and this is damp, I wrung out as much water as possible so here we go. <laughs> is the neutral set from Ben Nye. So this is the final look. As you can see, it's super basic. Um, I really just wanted to be able to focus on the concealer itself throughout the evening. It is a matte finish, I want to say. Well, I guess I can't really say, but I set it with powder just so I could do all my other concealers because I wanted to give it a fair chance. You know, it's not a bad concealer. I really did like how well it blended and I do like the color. Just from the looks of it, it is pretty matte. I would say, and that's with me setting it with powder, so I would say um, I might not have to set it with powder. I guess I'll try that next time, but so 
so far so good. So I will see you guys in a I'm getting ready to go to lunch with Rosa. This is me just now stepping outside with the concealer. Got some cupcakes. I'm taking these to work for my girl. Rosa! We're going to go to Chick-fil-A Chick today. Chick We're gonna get ooh, ooh. the sandwiches or whatever. A spicy chicken sandwich and a shake on the side. And I'm gonna get the number two with the shake. So I don't know that this concealer is gonna um, have any real play time with me just going to work, but we shall see. And I am gonna vlog the whole thing so everybody will get a close up of what's going on in my, under my eye. Else. Have you ever tried the Kat Von D concealer? I have not, so I will stay tuned for your review. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, we're just gonna go eat some food. I guess you're gonna be our guinea pig. Yeah, I'm gonna be everybody's guinea pig for makeup. So if you want me to review something, let me know down below. Don't be shy. Yeah, you be the guinea pig. So if it ruins your face, it ruins your face. Not mine. Not mine. <laughs> You get it mad, I'm getting rich. You get it mad, I'm getting rich. Hi you guys, so I am at work and it is now 8.30 p.m. <laughs> what's, what's your skin type? I don't know, you tell me. Combination dry or combination oily? Combination be net. <laughs> um, okay, so then you would be step three. So you're gonna use your soap and then you're gonna use Hey you guys, so it is nine o'clock and I have still been wearing this concealer. Um we're still closing the store. <laughs> I forgot to vlog, but anyways, this is how the concealer looks. It is still pretty good. I will say that it's super matte, so I probably won't have to set it with powder at all. I did set it with um, the Ben Nye neutral set, but this is how it looks. Not oily at all, so, so far so good. I'm gonna wear it for a few more hours just to see what's gonna happen to it. And then, I'll let y'all know. We're gonna do another test tomorrow. Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel. So, this is day two of me wearing the Kat Von D Lock It concealer. I got the shade Deep 34 and um, I didn't get to record me putting it on today but what I used to apply it the second time which is today is this Makeup of the Day Cosmetics concealer brush. It's called the ooh, Conceal Your Secret brush. So that's what I used and I just went in and I dabbed it and I put it on this morning well I guess it was the afternoon around 12 in the afternoon which is really early in the afternoon and it is now 7 06 p.m. so it's about six or seven hours <laughs> not really good at math so my impression of this concealer first of all um I like the packaging I think that this is really cute um, it, it's it's simple you know and the heavy-duty font is really cool um, I do like this too because it allows you to see the actual color of the concealer which I think is really important for any product just because it gives you an idea of what it's going to look like. But I really do like the packaging, it's convenient, um, you know even if you were a makeup artist and you were going to use this, this is really sanitary for you. So I like that it's in a tube and that I could just squeeze it out. I would honestly say that this concealer is... I would say that it's about medium to full coverage. It is water resistant. I do get really oily during the day. Um, 
it's not hot enough in Texas yet for me to start sweating. But I do get really oily and generally I'm a lot shinier right up in here than I am today. So it does a good job at keeping that from happening, keeping me from getting super shiny. And I find that right underneath my eyes, even though I'm shiny here, it still blends really well. It doesn't look like, you know, dry concealer and then like oily wet concealer. The consistency is not what I thought it would be. It's really, really fluid almost. Not, well not like water, it's kind of like, um, I don't even know, but it, it's like a combination of a really watery concealer and a creamy one. So the consistency is really cool and unexpected on my part. I thought it would be way thicker than that. I thought it would be thick like um, the It Cosmetics concealer, which theirs is creamier. So I like this a lot. I like the coverage. I like the packaging. I like how it wears. Um, I would say if you're going to set it with powder, don't use a lot. You definitely don't want to be baking with this concealer because even though it's not like 100% matte, I feel like it's satin. So if you put too much powder on, I feel like underneath your eyes it's going to look really, really dry. But overall, I would give this concealer an A+. It's really, really good to me. Um, I've used it a couple of times, but I've only used it underneath my eyes twice, and this is the second time. So, so far, so good. I used it under my brows the other day, and honestly, I think this is a good buy. If you're someone who likes Kat Von D or shops at Sephora, this is definitely a concealer that you have to pick up for yourself. Swatch it in the store if you have to. I really like it. Um, again, the price point, I wouldn't say it was... 21 or 25 dollars but i you know i definitely think it's worth it and um i don't have anything negative to say about it at the least i mean i, I don't there's I, mean, I don't have anything bad to say about this at all so if you're looking for a good concealer and there are some really good ranges of color in her collection check it out i hope you guys enjoy this if you'd like for me to try anything out Go ahead and comment below and let me know what it is that you'd like to see me try out so that you don't have to and maybe I can for you. Thank you again for watching this. Please thumbs up this video and share it because that would mean a lot to me. I hope you guys have an awesome day. Peace. Slow the motion. Don't get out of the way to no one. Long distance, I need you. When I see.